Greetings, you people. Hello, my king. Now, what's going on? How has it been? This is Mariah Stone. I do indeed welcome you back to some more Fallout 4 as who? As Donald Trump. Everybody, let's get back into it. Prepare your ears for nonsense. All right. Hey, baby. Follow up. Follow up. We, um... Why are you lagging behind? Oh, wait. Sorry. <laughs> I forgot. Weaker species and all that. Right. Uh, what's this? It's a door. That used... No, it's a wall. It used to be a door. As a politician, I know an open door when I see one. And that was no open door. Alright, look at this guy. Look at this guy. This is, this is, this is a, this is a Diamond City security. Right? See, Washington, Diamond City. I just did not know. I never knew. DC stands for, I was running for president and I had no idea what DC stood for. I mean, I wasn't going to admit that 200 years ago. But I'll admit it now because, you know... I'm surrounded by idiots. Right? So what are they going to do? Judge me? <laughs> right. Right. Doubt that's going to be the case. <laughs> Noise. Traffic cone. DC. Man, that just blows my brain. Get the latest issue of public occurrences. Hey, wait. Have you been writing while I've been gone? How was that possible? Did you... No. You took notes, though. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So what do you have to say about me? You better not be anything stupid. You don't work for the New York Times, do you? Well, she turned away from me. She might work for the New York Times. You might be a double-crossing piper. Could be. Yes. Look, was I looking at you? Do you think that I was ready to talk to you? Look, I'm important. You're not. Why would I talk to you? All right, let's go this way. Ooh, look at this then! Fire! And we're gonna go back and we're following uh, Nick Val. Well, he stealthed away. Very good then. Look at the this Diamond City Guard. You know what's so cool though is in Washington D.C. where there there used to be the White House is no longer there. Obviously, I didn't see it when I when I came inside of here. But you know what? They laughed at me when I said build a wall 200 years ago. But now, in the present, you see what happened? There's a big wall around this this establishment now. There's no... there's If only there was a wall instead of a piddly little fence, um, then maybe the, um, the global warmings might not have destroyed the White House, right? I mean, the White House was always very fragile. We already know this. I mean, what? Uh, it got set afire by the Canadians, so... We have to be careful. We have to be careful. But no, nobody actually took any note about that. They left it the way it was, except, well, they painted it white. But, uh, you know, they did. You know, they, 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 they allowed it to be run over. They allowed it to be run over by, uh, by global warmings. But now there's a wall around it. If only the wall was there first. If the wall was there first. Can I not? This is, okay, fine. There's a little, there's a little stick in the knob there. There's a little stick in the knob. I had to uh, jangle it, just jangle it. Nick. Oh, you're oh, welcome. God. It's really you. <laughs> well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Mm -hmm. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome there. Um, the, the thing is, is that um, I'm running, I'm running for president again. I know I'm 200 years late. Well, then again, I think all my competition is dead. Lucky that. So I am. Uh, I'm, I need money for this. About my reward. They always gotta ruin the moment with money talk. Well, you yeah. know. Every cap we agreed to for finding him, plus a little something extra. So well, thank you, know, you. If you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat. Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. Um, you really look the part there, hun. You really look the part. You know what? You're like my, my, my security and my wife. Whoa, that's a fantasy. Let's go here. We'll sit right here and talk to this, uh, this man. You're trying to man. find someone who's gone missing. The devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. Painful? Right. Um, yes. 
But hey, Piper's listening. Okay, so yes, I was I was totally helpless. I was totally helpless. That's a good word, right? That that gets people on your side. I was helpless. Describe the murderer. Describe Vault One Eleven. Describe kidnappers. What's with the hard look. Say something. I'm I'm a politician, and I need to think my words through. Wait, that's new for me. Actually thinking before I speak? Let's describe the kidnappers. There was a man and a woman. Yeah. They didn't say much. But I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team. Professionals. The kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. Mm. I'm not sure what the backup means, though. What else can you tell me? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Right, uh, I can tell you what uh, Sean looks like. He um, he has uh, he he looks like uh, this round and squishy. We're looking for my son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the Gunners, and of course there's the Institute. Ooh, I heard about the Institute. Honestly, what? tell me more about the Institute, um, because I need to know. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. Something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. I need that First in my life. All, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself discarded prototype anyway right um you're a prototype you're one of them finding Sean um hmm you're a prototype oh you know what uh, I'm gonna ask the question you're a prototype and I'm gonna act like I understand what he says next you're a prototype as far as I know never seen any other synth like myself mm. there's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal and there's the newer ones that are almost human I'm somewhere in between. Hmm. Right. Um, so let's get back on point. Uh, um, Piper, Piper, I'm going to ask about my son again. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Right, right, right. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? Um, mm, bald and scarred. Yeah. That could be anybody. That could be anybody. That could be me. Um, describe outfits. Yeah, let's describe the outfits, maybe. Or oh, distinctive voice. Carried a gun. Everybody carries a gun. Distinctive the outfit. Silent. The woman was dressed in, um, I think it was a kind of hazard suit. Right, right, right. The man had some sort of metal brace on his arm. Mm. Maybe some kind of improvised armor? A lot of hired guns do that to look tough. The hazard suit is interesting. Not many mercs can afford something that fancy. What else do you remember about them? Well, uh, the guy had a very distinctive voice. I'll never forget that voice. Low and rough. Like sandpaper across your face. Huh. Not much to go on, but a tough and commanding voice can get someone pretty far in the violence business. What else? Mm, he carried a big gun. The man who... Killed my wife. Nice, nice. He had a handgun. Mm -hmm. I didn't get a clear look at it, but that sound could have been a large caliber revolver. Huh. I'm starting to get a clearer picture of the kind of man our perp is. Anything more you can tell me? Um. Yeah, yeah. He was bald and scarred all over. One of them came right up to me. Bald head, scar across his left eye. Wait. It couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? Whoa, Kellogg! Man, you can't trust cereal. You just cannot trust cereal. I knew it. 
I knew it. I'm gonna have to ban cereal. I'm gonna have to make America great again, and cereal is one of the first things to leave. Absolutely. Um, I might have. I don't remember. No. I'm gonna say no. Waiting on you. I don't remember. I don't. I don't remember Kellogg. Um, n no. No. They never said their names. Mm. It's way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned wet stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. Mmm. I'm gonna go pistol whip in politician style, I think. Um. Another kidnapped kid. Why do I actually, you know, I'm gonna say another kidnapped kid? Maybe it's another kidnapped kid. Yeah, either that or he's got a son of his own. Not a comforting thought in any case. Both of them vanished a while ago. Haven't been heard or seen since. Mm -hmm. Let's you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. Yeah. Yeah. Whenever you uh, are in the business of politicianing like me. Haven't you? Nothing but garbage. Hope you and Nick find that monster. Oh, we'll find that monster. We'll find that. Isn't that right, Piper? And then you're going to love me for it. Um, listen, if things between you and the, uh, the robot break down. Uh, forget it. All right. Come on, Piper. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, I have to keep my options open. I'm Donald Trump. Um, let's see. Nick Valentine. Let's do. Why are we walking? I didn't want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance is bad news. He's more than just a mercenary. He's a professional. Quick, clean, thorough. Has no enemies because they're all dead. Right. Except you. But nine to one odds says he's our man. It's more than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all him as well. Leading a small team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later? Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. Alright. Just as an aside, one of the mods I'm going to grab for this as soon as possible is the mod that allows me to walk the same speed as the person walking next to me. Can we have that happen? Here we are. Keep an eye out, will you? Oh, I, I got more this. than an eye out. Piper, don't look at me, look around. That's one heck of a lock. Something to hide, Kellogg? Why don't you give it a try? Me? Unlock my, like, yeah, seriously? Lock tight. I can't get through that. No Don't luck. think I can pick this. We'll need to find a key. Find a key. Platform in the distance. Which one? City entrance. Yeah. That's the elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you go ask around there? I'll stay here and see if I can jimmy this lock. All right. Well, you and Jimmy stick around there, and I'll be back. I'll be back for sure. I will be. Come on, Piper, let's go to that platform that we saw across the way and uh, go persuade the mayor to give me, perhaps, the keys to the city. Listen, I'm going to be president hey, someday. Hey, paper, right? Vault dweller? Huh. You seem pretty normal. Of course I'm normal. I'm a, I'm a full-blooded American, just like you. You know how I know? You're carrying a gun, I'm carrying a gun. All right, um, let's go over here. I know these potential ramps. There's that lift I needed to do right there. Excellent. Um. Ooh, call elevator button. Let's do. Come on then, Piper. Come on, get up here. Come on, get on the lift. Get on the lift. Come on. Hey, there you go. Perfect. And up we go. So good. DC never looked better. Well, I, I did at one time, I think. To be honest, I never really looked around DC. Alright. Who are you then? Oh, I probably should put my weapon away. 
Put your weapon away, Piper. Jesus. Have some consideration for the uh, people without weapons. The mayor's receiving visitors, as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? Whoa! Alright, um... But, but... Piper? Well, I guess we're going in. House keys. Can I have some house keys? I'm gonna see the mayor. That's what I wanna do. So I can just head in and talk to McDonough? Go right ahead. His office is open. He likes to make time for everyone when he can. It's really strange, you know, if you think about it. I'm a politician, and I'm hanging out with the press. Although, if I can make the press my own, isn't that a great idea? Mm-hmm. I like... Wow. No funny business around the mayor. Got it? Why? Why would I be funny? Why would I be funny? I Listen, I'm a politician. I'm not funny. Ah, yes. I remember you. Oh, you do. Our new arrival. I remember you. I wish I was in your shoes, getting to see our glorious city for the first time. How can I help you? Um, well, I uh, need to get into Kellogg's house. A man named Kellogg used to live in this city. I need to search his house. I see. Well, whatever reasons you have, I take my citizens' privacy very seriously. Mm -hmm. Even after they've left. I can't allow you to invade someone else's home. That's all there is to it. Really? Um, I would have you know that, um... He's a kidnapper. Please, Mayor McDonough. This man, Kellogg, kidnapped my son. I need to find him. Oh, of course. I... I will do everything in my power to help you overcome this horrible personal tragedy. I remember Mr. Kellogg. Didn't yeah. like him myself. Paranoid. Never talk to anyone. I doubt you'll find him. But I insist you take the key to his old house. It's been abandoned, though. I'm afraid this whole thing might be fruitless. There we go. Well, then I got that key. Hey, Piper, he's not so bad. He's not so bad. He gave me the key. He gave me the key. That's so nice of him, isn't it? I'm going to sit down beside you and talk to you. Let's talk. Hey. You say the word. Something you need? Um, wait. No, 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 no. Thoughts, thoughts. 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 Your thoughts? Anything I can do? You just say the word. Um, what about thoughts now? Your thoughts? Doing the right thing rarely makes you popular. But I don't think I could live with myself otherwise. Hmm. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, relationship, um, the relationship again. Is everything all right between us, Piper? It's hard to say at the moment. Oh. I think I need you to show me you're not just out here for yourself. Well, no, no, I'm out here, I'm out here for, for the, the whole of America. I'm, listen, we're gonna make America great again. We are. Um, all we have to do is stuff. I don't have to build a wall anymore. I've already got it, in fact. The wall is... Around the central part of DC. Are you done talking? No, no, sorry, sorry. I um I mm, never mind. Oh, nothing. All I'm right. just thinking to myself, thinking to myself, thinking to myself. It's fine. I know you're new to our fair city, but the press is not allowed in this office. Tell Piper to wait outside. Come on, Piper. Let's go. Um we don't want to anger the mayor. I mean he's a politician too. And uh He's not running for president, and we don't want him to. So let's just let's let's hope that we can not piss him off to the point to where he wants to run for presidency. Because um, I'd hate to uh, show him up. I'd hate to show him up. Yes, that's what I would hate. Piper, are you coming or not? Thank you. Let's go. Get on. Get aboard. Yay! And down we go. Wow, that was dangerous. That was dangerous. You live dangerously. Vicariously. So do I. Winky face. Nothing stays hidden forever. At least, not if I have my say. Hmm. I wonder if I can get another paper and if I'm in it. Obviously, if there's a new paper, I am in it. I know I'm in it because I'm Donald Trump. Everybody's writing about me nowadays. It's fantastic. It's fantastic. The synthetic truth, read. Have I, wait. Hmm. Isn't there a new, um... Have I read this already? I think I did. Synthetic truth. Next. What, no, no, I just... Okay. Let's read. Hmm, yeah, these are the power noodles. 
Same counter, blah, 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 blah. We are at this. Okay, that's fine. All right, well, nice work and all that, um, but write about me next time. They have to put me in your stuff. Where am I going? Right, I have the key. I have the key to the house. Let's go back to the house. I'm easily distracted. Can't be easily distracted. How do I get up there? This way. Excellent. Stop. No. Go. Come on, Piper. I know you're behind me somewhere, right? Yes, you are. Excellent. You know what? She's tailing that far back to make sure there's no uh, body shadowing us. That's what I'm thinking. Got the key? All right. Let's head in. You do the honors. All right. Let's go. <laughs> the pit boy keeps saying, hey, level up. Hey, level up. You know what? You around. can level up right now. Kellogg must have left something behind. Um, well, yeah. Um, I'm thinking right now that Kellogg is a serial killer. He's a... Wah, wah. Okay, anyway, um... Place seems small to you. I think a guy like Kellogg would think big. I'm gonna take all that stuff. I don't know why. I'm gonna sell it. Listen, I'm an entrepreneur. Take what you can find and you sell it to the mm, uh, dumbest person. Can I have that? Excellent. Let's go this way. Uh, nothing here. Did you check out that desk? Oh, corn. I'll take that corn. And all this stuff there, too. And a cooking pan. Wait! Hey, Piper! I found something. I'm gonna give it to you in a second. I mean, I'm gonna give you the, the gift. I'm telling you, something's not right. Look for anything out of... Oh, wait. Swords. A switch. A button. A switch. A button. Oh, oh okay. Let's look around for a switch. Button. Could totally do this. Could totally... Cutting board. Wait, is there a cutting board there? Oh, there is. All right. Woo! Found it. Well, that's one way to hide a room. Excellent. Okay, so this guy certainly is not on the up and up. Only um people who have things to hide have little uh hidden rooms. That's a great idea. Hey Piper, you want a hidden room? I know I do. Nuka Cola Quantum, potato crisps, purified water sounds All great. All of a Merc's favorite thing. Potato crisps? Really? You think so? Mercs love potato crisps. You learn something new every day. Orange mintats. Ooh, they taste like orange. Instant mash. I'm carrying too much to be able to run. That's fine. No, no, no. Pork and beans. I'm gonna keep my food. Um, can I have the... No, seriously. Can I have the ammo? Thank you. Anything down here that's probably hidden? Uh, dirty, dirty water? No. No. Oh, uh, iguana bits. Yes. That's good. Okay, talk to me there, um, Piper. Piper? Can you... Can I not? There we go. Hey. What can I do? Um, you can Don't trade some things. Don't mind the clutter, it's fine. Um, let's go ahead and give you... things. Uh, let's sort by weight. No, I did it, went too far. There we go, good. Um, we're gonna give... Oh, the broom. Awesome. You can have that. Um, you can have a desk fan to cool off. It's great. And some paint. You can have that too. Fat man, you know what you can carry? Piper can't carry... Can't carry anymore, really? Is that, is that a thing? Well, I, at least I'm underweight right now. I don't have to carry anything else. That's good. Um, Nick Valentine, what did we find? We found gamma rounds. Really? In a fusion cell? What is that all about? San Francisco Sunlights. Gwinnett Stout Beer, 44 caliber bullets, and cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. Hmm. Right. Well, um, oh, wow, what do you think there, detective? Any suggestions, Nick? Guess it's time to call in a favor. I know a specialist. He's never in one place for long, but he'll show up if I ask. Um, well, who is it? Who's this friend of yours, Nick? Worked with him a few times, but he only likes certain people. Got a feeling you'll get on, though. Oh you man! Soon enough, can I send out the signal? It's a special frequency, so you won't hear it, but he will. Okay, I called him. Let's wait outside. Well, you saying I wouldn't hear it? I totally heard it. Does that make me a synth then? Oh my God! That's how I survived two hundred years. I'm a synth. Now I'm definitely gonna have to, uh, you know, make sure that synths have rights. Definitely have to make. Since have rights, isn't that right, Piper? You can write about that. You can write about that. Put that in your next, uh... Are you writing at all anymore? 
Seriously, I have you on so that you can see my good side and you can write about it. And only about my good side. Which is basically on all sides, to be honest. I have a good side this way, this way, and this way. Ah, and especially from... Prompt as always. Ooh! Ready to get to work, dog meat? What? Excuse me? Uh... Uh... E e if all I needed was a dog, why'd I bother saving you? Just consider getting me out of that vault of finders, V. Give dog me a whiff of that cigar, see if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. You can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Um, come with me. That means I have to get rid of Piper. Um, no, I need to make a relationship with Piper, so I'm going to say... What's your advice on this? Any words of wisdom? Kellogg really is the one who kidnapped your son. And he's dangerous. But so are you. You don't need to be afraid of him or anything else the Commonwealth throws at you. Why no? Well then, um, uh, goodbye the Nick for goodbye, now. Nick. Hopefully not forever. I want to see you and your kids safe and sound when you get back. Very good. Good luck. Anytime you need help, just come knocking. No, absolutely, we'll do. Um, so I'm gonna show uh, dog meat of the cigar. Dog meat, get the scent, boy. Got the scent, sarcastic. I'm trusting my family's future to a dog. That's it. I'm officially crazy. <laughs> I never thought Donald Trump would actually say that. Well, you know, to admit the things that everybody else knows. Um. Okay, very good. Um, getting a clue. That's great. Uh, let's see. Let's go for... What? Reunions. Hey, this is great. Okay. I, I have I have unwittingly done things that uh, seem to be pointing me in the right direction. I want to follow Dogmeat in just a moment, but first things first, I have to be an entrepreneur. Let's go be entrepreneurish. Stand a swatter. I'll take my chances on We this got side. small arms, long right. arms, ammunition. City supply. Wait, not you, not you, not you. What? Arturo Rodriguez. <coughs> Wait. It's the new guy. That's you, right? Uh, you remind me of a liberal. Uh, maybe. You're not gonna shoot me, are you? New guy. Maybe. Yes. Um, yes. Yeah, I'm the new guy. Well, it's good to have you here. Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. Mmm. I stand to make a lot of money here. Um, let's see. Let's barter. I'll take a look. Sure. Watch this, man. Something Watch this. For everyone. Wait! No! No, 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 no! No, no, no! Stop it. Get out of that. I have an idea. I have to go and, uh, have to level up first. Because, 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 I need big sale. What is this? You master the art of the deal. Buying and selling prices are the... Yes! Bam! Just like so. Now then, now let's talk to him. Arturo. Got some great stuff, if you're interested. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm definitely interested. I'll take a look, sure. Everything hand-tooled. You know what? There are so many things that I want to say right now in the vein of Donald Trump that I know would spew. I, I just, I know, I know how to be very offensive right now. Um, but I'm not going to. I'm just not going to. I'm just, I can't. I cannot do it now. There's some places I just can't go, and that's, this is one of them. Okay, um, let's see. I'm going to go for, uh, you know what, let's just sell everything. I think. My inventory. Let's go for all my junk. No, my junk. I'm going to keep. My miscellaneous. Grognet the Barbarian. I will sell that. I'll sell all these things. Um, San Francisco Sunlights. You know, Subway Token. I'm good for making money. Look at all this money I'm making right now. This is fantastic. Tesla Science. I don't know what that is. Let's get rid of it. Synthetic truth, let's get rid of that torn letter, sure. I'm going to sell somebody's letter to somebody else. You're special. Well, I know. I'm getting rid of it. Um, and we're going to go for my aid. Do I have any of this stuff? You know what I'm going to get rid of is that damned beer. I don't need a beer. That's, um, that's low-brow liquor. I have the high-brow liquor. The stuff that costs more, like the bourbon. Buff out. Now yeah, I'll get rid of that, too. Canned dog food. I have dog meat there. I, what it, dogs eat rocks, right? That's fine. Um, corn. I'll keep that for the mm, off chance that I want to eat it. Blood pack. I, I support the blood drive, so let's, let's keep the blood pack around to uh, to show that. Dirty water. Gumdrops. Um, no. 
Iguana Bites, Iguana Soup, Insta Mash. You know what? I, I, I'm just going to get rid of this stuff. I don't need this. Melon, I'll keep. Mintats, I will keep. Because my intuition, not my intuition, my intelligence goes up. What, really? Mintats make your intelligence go up? And, and perception? Interesting! That's almost a cheat for me. Um, pork and beans, I'll keep. Potato crisps, you can have. Psycho! I'll keep that psycho. Purified water, I'll keep that too. Rad X. I don't need that many Rad Xs. You can have that. How much do you have right now? 400 or 440. Okay, so I'm running out of uh, room. Sugar bombs. You're going to have that. Sweet roll. I'll give it to you. Just because it's a sacrilege. Um, whiskey, Tato, Stimpak. That's all good. Anything else I want to grab or get rid of? My apparel. Ooh. You know what? I'm going to sell that to somebody else, I think. I'm going to sell that to somebody else. So we're just going to accept that. We're going to set this to be what it is. Yes, confirm trade. I've got 1,067. This is how I build my well, my campaign, my future. I could figure out a good use for it. Hey, look at that vault dweller on the paper. What? There's a paper? You read a paper about me, Piper? You didn't. Island City surplus, everything you need. Yeah, let's you? talk to you. I, I don't know you. Just keep your distance. Listen, listen. I have made several trades with you before. You know your 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 people. I have made several trades, so let's uh, let's let's continue trading then. Calm down. Keep calm. I'm standing still. That's exactly what a synth would say. But I don't know. Are you really uh, human? Um. <sighs> no, I'm sarcastic. No, I'm Jangles, the Moon Monkey. That's <laughs> just what a synth would do. Ducking the question. We don't serve your kind here. Really? Hey, Myrna. I said we don't serve your kind here, you synth. Trying to tell me you're human now? Well, I'm human. I can convince you because I'm a politician. Politicians are hu human. This doesn't exactly seem like the best uh, line of reasoning. Human as the day I was born. Well, you do look human enough. But I'll be watching you. I have eyes like a... What? Careful. Well, they're good eyes. Got it? Mm. All right. We can do business, but no funny stuff. Very good. Um, we're gonna barter. I'll take a look. Sure. Just don't call it junk. Uh, well, okay, I'm not gonna call it junk, but I am going to uh, go to my junk. No, my apparel, and I'm gonna get rid of the oh clean tan suit. I'm gonna keep that eyeglasses. I'm gonna get rid of that. Um, faded trench coat. Mmm, don't need a laundered cream dress. I need to get that to Piper. In fact, in fact, there's a lot of these things I'm just gonna do off. Off camera, I think. You know what? Cancel trade in progress. Yes. I'll do this off camera. Because it's not very interesting. And besides that, I have to end this episode. If there's anything about this episode that you did indeed enjoy, any amount of uh, offensiveness that you found uh, offensive, good. Um, leave a like and uh, I'll see you again later. Have a good day. Have a good evening wherever you are in the world. This is Barrera Stone signing out.